Hi guys, welcome to my crazy life. It's Lori. Ooh, and I still have my hair pinned up. Just ignore the clip. That's how I train my bangs to flip in the morning when my hair's wet. Anywho, we're gonna do a little vlog today. I am headed out to the Backwoods Festival. It's um, in a town called Thornville, Ohio, and it's in the woods. And it's a craft festival and I can't wait to go. So I'll bring you some footage from that. But I wanted to share with you a new product. It was sent to me, but the opinions are my own. It's called Ginger, well, it's from Ginger Army. I'm sorry, Ginger Armor. And it's a mineral sunblock spray and moisturizer. It does say that one to three sprays with, oh, it's on the inside. One to three sprays protects and hydrates your face. It has Aragon oil, bisabolol, coconut, rosemary extract, squalene, vitamin E, zinc, and more. It's rich in antioxidants and anti-inflammatories. And you know me, I gotta stay out of the sun. So I just sprayed it on. I will give it a little zhuzh in, just because I never trust the sprays. I'm not saying I don't trust this spray, I'm just saying I always like to give it a little rub in. I can feel the oils, I can tell you that. Oh, it feels so soft. So I would maybe do this before my makeup. If you wear any kind of foundation, I can't see you better. Any kind of like foundation or anything like that, but oh. It's nice. So I'll keep it in my bathroom and use it as my daily moisturizer. And when I get home today, we'll see if I'm sunburnt because um, it is going to be a sunny day. So again, Ginger Armor, the link will be in the description box below. Oh, I got some in my eyeball. Okay. I like that. Oh, it feels so soft. And you know, we need all the moisture help we can get. Right now, I am currently making coffee. And then I'm gonna feed the boys because it's their feeding time. It's 8.30 on a Saturday morning. Uh, my boys get the Sheba Perfect Portion Pate because that's all Wellington will eat. He's so spoiled. Um, yeah, I'm excited to go. I love to go to this craft, craft festival. There's lots of unique items. And I believe it's only items. Sorry, I had to get cat food off my hand. Only oil, um, oils, only products made local in Ohio. So there's not any Tupperware salespeople or anything like that. It's all handmade items. They have food, they have music that you can sit and listen to. They have, you know, food vendors, music vendors. There is a guy or business that makes homemade pork rinds. Last year, actually several years, they've been sold out before I get there. So I told my niece, I'm like, we gotta go early this year. So it's a Friday, Saturday, Sunday situation. But I work on Friday. I have football on Saturday. So I worked the football game yesterday. So today is the only only day I can go. Hi, boys. Oh, yeah. Do you hear him? Him's crazy. Here, Dobby. Oh, here you go, Baba. I'm coming back. Do you like how I call the cat that's deaf? I can't hear. And I'm yelling for him because it's just habit, I suppose. It's all right, baby. Um, you know that I call him. Let's turn you this way so I can make my coffee. I have some errands to run. I need to go to CVS. I have to pick up a prescription on my way out. I already got cash. Um, vendors do take credit card, but... If they take cash, I prefer that. Plus, they're, um, like if I do use a credit card, their company will charge them 
30% or I'm sorry, 3% of a processing fee. So I just prefer to have cash. You know, these are small vendors, but I also get really good ideas for things I can make for Christmas. So I do a little shopping and then I do a little looking. Oh, my hair. It's wet today and it's also, well, I just washed it. Well, wet it. I don't wash it every day. So it's day two hair. All right, let's get moving. Say hi. Say hi, Michael. Hi. hi. <gasps> See, look, I got a salt. There's what? a dog. There's a dog. Well, yeah. But it's all about the sports, right? You want a marshmallow shooter? <laughs> Functional ceramics. Okay. Just a towel. Um, I had some egg bites. I got them at Sam's. They're delicious. They're sausage egg bites. And I put them in the air fryer. Some of the uh, brioche buns and I made Michael some breakfast sandwich. Oh, nice. I've been keeping some, like... I've been doing really well with my intermittent fasting. Okay. You know where I'm stopping. I'm in my own. We're away from all the crap. Just stop the table time. But he now drives a truck for a living. So we're oh. talking about him and like a dog. French fries. French fries. I want to do the apple dumpling and ice cream. Ice cream as my meal. Sure did get pork rinds. Do we need another necklace? I did enjoy it. He asked for if there was a like chance of the family to rally and get some money together to get him a new bowling ball. Doesn't he have like 47? Right. But my mom had to like break it to him because he was talking about like the Alaska. We'll walk around slow. I have water. They might. All right, let me make my video. Okay, we are out of the festival. Oh, it was so fun. I love walking around. There were so many people, much more people than there usually is. I got a cup of iced tea, but now it's water. So I'll put it in my sleeve and I'll show you what I bought. It was hard for me to get too much close up video. Plus I feel weird videoing people's crafting stuff because I think they feel like I'm stealing ideas or something, which I'm not. Um, I got water. I got, oh, I got some Buckeye earrings because I don't have any Ohio State earrings to wear to football games. So those are the earrings I got. Just little Ohio State earrings. I think they were $7. Prices were very reasonable, and they usually are here. And then I picked up pork rinds. Homemade, fresh pork rinds. Salt and vinegar and buffalo. 
I know. Don't be jealous. And then I got two for me and one for a gift. Let me put this back in its bag. So these, they make them fresh. Like, right there, you watch them get made. Um, these are chapstick holders. So you, oops, that's a gift. This one is mine, and I actually have a cup koozie that matches this. I'll show you here in a second, but you um, slide your chapstick in it, and it can go on your key ring or not. You can hook it onto something, but yeah, it holds your chapstick, which I love these things. And they were three for $10, so I got this cat pattern, which I have the same fabric in a cup koozie that I ordered from Chewy.com. And then for Sarah for Christmas, I have this for her. And I think somewhere in this car of mine, well, somewhere there is a pink chapstick holder for your car but if not I will order her one online for stocking for Christmas I'm putting this away and then oh, my console there we go um, for Christmas I got this one which is it's blue and black or blue and red but that's okay for Christmas I know so those were three for ten they had so much stuff here, but I didn't need to get a lot. But I did get a lot of good ideas of what I can make for Christmas. So that was everything we did at the Backwoods Festival. I hope you enjoyed that little video and a little insight into where we are. We're literally in a field. My shoes are covered in mud because it rained last night. All right, guys, have a good one. I'm going to go home and decorate for Halloween on my front porch. And you'll see that video up probably after this one. Have a good one.